What's up, guys? Professor K here with Ed, and we have another build and battle, uh, build and battle kit case. Man, oh man! For some reason, that just does not ever come out correctly. Anytime I try to say it, mm -mm. we've got ten build and battle kits here of Chilling Rain. I've opened up ten. He's opened up ten, and now we're gonna open up ten together. Yep, ten ca ten cases of Chilling Rain. Cases? Ten yes. cases? Yes. You mean one case of nope. ten kits? <laughs> Nope. <laughs> Choking on your food there? Yes. <laughs> this right. is a case. That's a kit. It's a case. <laughs> it's a case of kits. Oops. <clears throat> it's a big case of smaller cases. All right. Well, let's see what we end up with here. We have uh, pretty much, if you guys have seen any of the other ones, we've already gotten every single one of the uh, Chilling Rain promos. Yeah. There come out so you know we're not gonna spend a whole lot of time on them but we do want to see how many of each we actually end up getting because that's always interesting to me to have that data cody james Chuckle. what's up dude i haven't seen your name around here in a while welcome back my friend oh i just realized something about this and a happy though. chuckle to you as well the cigarettes is racing with a score bunny i never realized that oh i didn't either it just looked like another flame around it yeah <laughs> Like, like, it's doing, like, running in place and the score buddy's trying to keep up. <laughs> That's actually really cute. <laughs> That's awesome. Unfortunately, Raboot is not in there, but that's okay. Inteleon. By far the best promo in here. I think they're all good. They're all good, but Inteleon's best. I don't know. Ever since I noticed that score buddy, I don't know anymore. <laughs> And random Cresselia. I don't know why, but Cresselia just does not fit into this. I don't know why it got the promo treatment. I mean, you gotta think about it. Look how big Volcania was. That's the same thing for Psychic. I mean, yeah. True. So I, I totally understand why I did. I just mean as a Pokemon. It just feels weird. I mean, you got two Sword Shield, a Sun and Moon, and... You got Diamond Pearl, you got the most recent, you got the last recent, and you got the thing that's getting a remake this year. I guess you're right there. Not to mention, I did not even notice the Drizzile in the background of the Basimian card. <laughs> What's in the background of this one? Or if there even is. Nope. Okay, so it's just these two that have background Pokemon. That's cool. Because Cresselia does not, unfortunately. I'm going to help I, you out. I also like the regular like Pokemon and some of these recent sets that have the, their trainers in the background. Yes. Like the Lapras in this set has Melody in the background. Um, in Cosmic Eclipse, a lot of the uh, GX have had their trainers in the background. That's actually surprising. We got the playset of Inteleon. Nice. Out of one kit case. So four, three Cinderace, two Passimian, and one Cresselia. That's really cool. That's kind of like the best case situation there. Best case best case because <laughs> it's a case <laughs> oh i'm sorry i committed the ultimate crime what? i've i've Puns? set i've set a pun <laughs> <laughs> nothing wrong with puns except everything That depends on who you're asking. Hey, look, another Saw's Buck. Saw's Buck. I literally just have the reverse rare right now. Right there. Go Lurk. Steel. Just got the reverse down a tree hill and a Saw Beach. Gee, baby swag, thanks for the 69. Nice bits. Nice. The dumb tees. The what? The dumb tees. Oh, I thought it said the dumb tees. I was like, what are the dumb tees? I don't know. Um, this would be the dump tee right here. Ha <laughs> ha! Because it's, uh, it's like Humpty Dumpty. That's amazing. What was that timing? <laughs> this card's actually kind of stupid and expanded. Oh my gosh. That's too funny. Blissey is now Dumpty confirmed. Who's Humpty then? Uh, Chansey. Ah. And 
There's that. Nice. Reverse welcoming lantern and a wheezing. I think we're gonna get another alternate art. I would love to see a coughing or wheezing with um James in the background. That'd be cool. James is the Pokemon master, okay? I mean, he was right about the Magikarp. Everyone then, laughed at him. Any of his Pokemon, he literally just like, hey, do you want to come with me? And they're all running to his Pokeball. Like, he doesn't have to battle any of them. They just want to go with him. Do you mean Ash? Because, like... No, I mean... That's a thing. No, I mean James. <laughs> I mean James. I know, but they both have that same effect. Well, okay, not, all, not always with Ash. Most of them, though. Most and, of the uh, ones he ends up with. And honestly, you can't... You cannot tell me that Ash loves his Pokemon more than James. Because James loves his Pokemon. That'd be a really interesting comparison, because they're pretty close in that department. Ooh, I love that. Look at that Moltres yeah. looks. Got that Galarian Moltres. Snorunts. Hunter. And we got MVP Rare. Glade. And just like the Zamazenta, what's... He's like Zamazenta. Like, Zamazenta wasn't that good when he first came up, and now Zamazenta's an amazing card. After rotation, this Glade's gonna be amazing. Because we're only gonna have V and Standard. Not to mention, Eternatus shudders in fear of that card. Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely. Because honestly, it could, in the right condition, it could one-shine Eternatus even without weakness. So even if they have a weakness guard, that may not protect them. Subble. And Metagross! Nice. That's actually one of the better looking uh, full art color combinations, in my opinion. Got Scott. Very nice looking card. Reverse Rare Serena and a Golurk. James suffers for his Pokemon. Chewed poison and chewed some more. Mm hmm. And not to mention, James recently caught. Oh, spoilers, by the way. But See. James caught more Peko. And uh, Ricky Tan up there agrees. 90% of Ashes go with him. So. James has a bottle cap collection. He does, yes. The chase cards in Team Up Short and Sword and Shield and Base and Cosmic Eclipse. Boom. Oh, man. Full Art Melanie. Full Art Melanie. Where's Grovile? If he's still here. <laughs> I actually That's own, a nice one. I actually own this card IRL, too. I do not. Like, in my booster <laughs> box, back-to-back, back, I got the Rainbow Melanie Jables and too. the regular. That's right, Jables was the other one. It was Grovile and Jables, both of them. Well, I got Tornadus. <laughs> it's Thunderous all over again. Ugh. No more Thunderous. By the way, for those of you who don't know that story, uh, we went to the Roaring Skies pre-release. <laughs> I pulled like crazy. He only pulled the Thunderous EX, which honestly is one of the worst EXs I've ever seen. But I was trying to cheer him up, so I was like, hey, that card can be good. There's yeah. some playability to it. And everyone else was ripping on him, and I, st and I stood up for him that day. And I was like, hey, he pulled a good card. Right. Hey, I actually did, though. I know, but we all knew it was trash. Oh, yeah, it's... It was beyond garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Never was going to be good. <laughs> no. I, I literally got that thing. It was one of the worst EXs ever printed. Yup. I'm going to actually save that one because I only have one pack left. Oh my gosh. I was way ahead of you. Yeah. I want to end it on something. Maybe we'll have something. Ooh, Articuno! Passimian and Slurpuff. Alright. What are we gonna end this one on? We got Snorunt. And. Ooh, a reverse ray and a Beedrill Hollow. 
Shadow Knight. Yeah. Yeah. The Chase Ultra Rare in the set. Shadow there we Knight. go. That's a nice one right there. Very, very nice. Underworld Door. Probably one of the most dumbest abilities ever. Attach a Psychic Energy card from your hand to one of your benched Pokemon. If you attach energy to Pokemon, draw two cards. Jeez. So it's acceleration and draw power. Yeah, it's pretty busted. All in one card. And then it does 30 more damage for each Psychic Energy attached to all of your Pokemon. So the attack, too, is also... Oh, yeah. It's a minimum of, of a, what is it, 30, 60, 90, 120 with all Psychic. Yep. And it just builds up from there. Mm-hmm. Got a Weavile Hollow. Because that's, you know, not busted or anything. Nah, not at all. Okay, so Heracross Reverse and a Dig Trio Rare. I think it's funny that the other uh, one is called Ice Tray. <laughs> Two, three, four, the other deck. Five, six, seven, eight. Seven, oh, you annihilated me again. Nine, 10, 11. Oh, that's all you got? That's all I got, plus like three hollows. Oh, goodness. What yeah. was your reverses? Oh, wow. It was garbage. <laughs> no, I, I did not stand a chance. Did not stand a chance. Because that's only... Well, this is only 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. I might have had like 21 or 22 points. So, Shame on you. Yeah. It was pretty bad. I picked the wrong side. But that's okay. Because we still had some pretty cool pulls. Okay, Obviously, definitely. these two cards being the coolest of them anyway. Well, these three, really. Mm. Being the coolest of them. So, there you have it. Honestly, most of these cards are pretty decent. Like here. No. No. <laughs> most but, of these cards are pretty decent. No. Okay, no. Well, I said most, not all. I said most. <laughs> so that's good. <laughs> that's really good for a deck. This is really good for not only Eternus, but Dark Box is back now because of this. This is a new target for Eternus. And as I said, this has potential. So mo most of this is good. All right, if you say so. <laughs> what does a Metagross do? Um, Bullet Punch and Synchro Hammer. It's good to have the same amount of energy attack. Nah, it's bad. <laughs> is there a Metagross Vmax in the set? Um, I don't remember. I feel I don't like there might, might. I don't remember. I don't remember. It's been a while since I've opened up Chilling Rain too. We're uh, definitely behind the curve. Really? Y'all decided to put the Buzzlord clip up there? <laughs> I had forgotten the Buzzlord. Oh, the miss speaks on this channel. <laughs> Buzzlord. Oh, goodness. All right. So for those of you watching on YouTube, thank you so much for sticking with us to the end here and watching me annihilate this man here again. It's been that way all day. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell, like, comment down below, and if you're not already subbed to us on Twitch, what are you doing? You're missing us doing all this live, being able to interact with us. You're missing us doing all the stuff that doesn't get aired on YouTube, plus you're missing us curse. We use curse words outside of this channel, and you're missing it. So, what are you doing? What are you doing? It's only five bucks. It's true. It's, that's true. You don't have five dollars? <laughs> <laughs> you all will probably know where that's from. Or most of you will anyways. So, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Take care and have a great day.